Let's go. Wait, that's not what Link would say. Yeah! That's what Link would say. Welcome to the Age of Calamity. Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. We're going to be starting a new game today. And I have beaten this game before. But interesting fact is I beat this game before the DLC came out. And then I played the DLC after I beat the game. And I realized that the DLC of this game adds some skill trees and content to the game that almost doesn't make sense to have if you've already beaten the file. So I was thinking to myself, I'm like, if I ever, I need to play this game again now that all the DLC is out because it's gonna be an entirely different experience. Like they added stuff that should have just been base game content. Very interesting choices, but I'm excited to play this game now that it's like the finished version of it so I can get the full experience. I really dislike how they'll release unfinished games and then like finish them through DLC. So annoying, but the game is finished, finally. So we're gonna experience the game the way the devs, I guess, probably intended. This game is a prequel to Breath of the Wild, Legend of Zelda. It takes place 100 years before the events in that game. And from what I remember, the story and cutscene are more entertaining than the cutscenes in Breath of the Wild, so that's something to look forward to. Yes. Delete my data. Delete it! Difficulty, whoa! Okay, last time I played the game was normal mode, and it was way too easy. There's hard, very hard, and apocalyptic. I'm gonna go with hard. I'm not playing apocalyptic mode. I'm not crazy. Let's spank some Bacoblin booty. Very pumped for this, very pumped. This game is really, really good. Where are we at? Are we in hell? We just got stomped on. Wow, this game starts off cheerful. Spiders. I love how Calamity Ganon looks like a giant shark cloud. Nasty ass. What is going on? Straight into the complications. What's in the box? What's in the box? What? Damn, Zelda got the riz. She got that gold light. Wait, what just happened? Little baby guardian? But he's just a small egg. A little small egg. He's the Hylian R2-D2. I must protect everyone. Zelda, you can't protect everyone. That's an overextension. We need some therapy. Whoa, was that like a time vortex? Huh? <laughs> He's too big to fit. No, why would you kill him? What? Why did he try to kill his own baby? Oh, he's just getting... He got yeeted through that portal. Poor little baby. Not the hieroglyphs. God, they freaking... Nintendo loves this hieroglyph. They use it so much in Breath of the Wilds. And they had to show it again in Age of Calamity, of course. I think Nintendo needs to realize that people don't look like looking at their hieroglyphs for like 20 years. They look cool. Oh, I kind of want the little baby guardian as a tattoo. He's kind of cute. What if that was my Zelda tattoo? Little baby guardian. He has a little blue eye. I can make it black ink with a little blue eye. 
Hyrule Warriors, Age of Calamity. Gotta say it in a movie trailer voice. Burb! Burb! Wow, this is a nice day. Hyrule Castle's looking nice pre-apocalypse. King Rome, defier of prophecy. Listen well, soldiers of Hyrule. In our long history, we have scarcely faced a threat of this magnitude. The years have passed quickly since Calamity Ganon's revival was prophesied. Yes, we have unearthed the divine beasts and filled volumes with our knowledge of ancient relics. But a barricade of books will not protect us. Because this way surges a horde like we have never faced before. Even now, the enemy is clawing for our throat. For Hyrule Castle itself. We must exterminate the monsters roaming Hyrule Field. Thus, we'll begin our renewed effort to stop the Calamity. Whoa, his sword is sick. Now, go forth. Nice. Dude, Link is so sick. His eyes are so pretty in this game. All right, we're in it. We're in the action. Charge! The resolution of this game is not too hot. I honestly really hope we get this game remade in a higher resolution in the future. But it's still fun to kick a bunch of bokoblins in the ass. What's our unique action? Whoa, we got the freaking bow? How many bokoblins does it want us to kill? I'll kill a thousand. No problem. Prevent their retreat. We've got them now. Fire. Where does it want us to go? Up in the corner? I gotcha. I'm on it. Oh, we got a special attack gauge filled up. Damn, this is a lot of bokoblins. Let's kill as many as possible. Tornado. Oh, that was nice. What's this to kill the moblin? Mobbin with my moblins. Oh, who are we fighting? Dude, moblins. They got a good swing. His weak point is showing. Smack those moblin cheeks. Oh, did you see that dodge and that guard? I think he knows what he's doing. This guard is a lot about dodging. Gotta dodge a lot. Yeah. Treasure. It's all mine. What did I get? Use the healing item. Oh, cool. I just ate an apple. All right, let's go ahead and get this outpost. That's one of the missions of the game is to try to steal as many outposts as possible for your team. Got to lower their numbers so they can't continue attacking you. Because apparently, the moblins are having lots of sweet, succulent, baby-making love in these outposts. And it can produce infinite amounts of new moblins. So you gotta come in here and stop them from making babies. These boys are reproducing like flies. Whoa! Here's the leader. This is the queen bokoblin. Go ahead and take him out. Ah, uh, yeah. Get him, get him, get him. Oh, he's he's exposed. He's exposed. I can't see anything. It's so weird seeing a wall jump button in a Zelda game. <laughs> it's not something you would expect normally. Not in my Zelda game. 
Captured it. Right. Now we have the Hylian soldiers here, and they can make babies, right? Aren't they gonna take over? Where are they at? Where are my soldiers? I guess nowhere. <gasps> Chews! Can I get Choo Jelly? What is that? Yeah, Choo Choo Jelly. Keep on a lookout for pinwheels. That's right, there's Koroks as well. I don't think I've missed any yet. I think we do have one in this level though, don't we? Did I miss a pinwheel? Okay, we're gonna have to go back for it. I I've already collected all the Koroks on my own. So this time we'll do it as a team. Me and the two clan working together. Just, just go, just go. Take over the breaks over. Ooh, we got that Hylian herb. That good Hylian za. What did I just do? What's happening? <gasps> Butterfly? Oh, we just found R2D2. I actually forget his name. Is that, who is that, is that? I thought that was Paya for a second. That's Impa. Your young Impa looks like Paya. What, that's crazy. Sheikah Slate? Oh my, he's a Gen Zer since in an iPad in the vicinity. He wants it instantly so he can watch his Coco Melon. <laughs> What is happening? Earthquake? The face off. What in the world? <laughs> oh, that's one way to win a battle, I guess. It's a tower? You will remember me. Remember me for centuries. Such a cute little egg with a slide whistle. Damn, slide whistle egg is so cute. Okay. We're in a different part of the map. I'm going up here real fast to find that Korok. I need it. I'll let you guys kill the Bacoblin. I never checked up here in the map. Oh, it really put me far down, didn't it? Link runs so fast in this game and you gotta love it. We got the remote bombs. Blow up all of our new troops. There it is. Yeah. -ha -ha. And he still gives us Korok poop, of course. I really hope Korok seeds aren't the collectible again in Tears of the Kingdom. I hope the collectible are tears. You know, like the tears that you find in Twilight Princess? I hope we have to find the tears and they're hidden all over the kingdom. Cryonis. Whoa, I forgot about that. That is amazing. Shoo. That is, I just wrecked that big goblin. Oh, that felt so good. Dude, trying to ride the bandwagon. Here's R2D2, hi Egg. This game is like so much fun to just like shut your mind off to and just like kill thousands of enemies. It's just so satisfying to watch so many enemies just swiped. When you come in, you press A and you go. Nobody stood a chance. An ancient shaft. No comment. Ooh. Can I... There we go, we shot some explosives. Here's some bombs. If y'all wanted some of that. Oh. He's weak to bombs, but I can't use him at the moment. 
There we go. Shattered. It's a weakness. Can I get him? Can I get him? Weak point. Where's it gonna go? I just sliced his whole stomach open. Dude, all this food. We're eating good tonight. All right, let's go capture the next outpost back. Dude, this, this whole environment is so pretty. Like we don't see environments like this in Breath of the Wild because everything's freaking destroyed. But this is beautiful. Like imagine this full of travelers and villagers and people who lived here. It's still like under attack right now, so it's still not that much different. Dude, they just clubbed me. That was actually pretty hard. Can I shoot that? It's like hitting them first. There we go. Look at this market. Look at all the food. It looks so good. This is a big level too though. That's for sure. There we go. We gotta attack them before they can club us. Who's the bigger man? Definitely not you all. They are strong though, I'll give him that. Takes quite a few hits to kill them all. That always does the trick. Whoa, where'd you come from? Oh wait, I should have timed that better. I didn't do anything. That's what happens if you don't time it. I guess my thing, it might fill back up. Oh, Cryonis. Oh, he ran into my eyes, what a dumbass. That was a really cool combo. He's weak, he's weak. See you later, you rascal. We got the meats. A fire whiz robe. Can I switch to a character nearby? Dang it, I should have used my arrows again. I fell for it. Oh, we can't, we can play as Impa. Let's go. Such a goaty character. I love Impa. My first time I played this game, I like focused on Impa for the first like 20 levels. That's the best thing about this game is there's so many characters and they're all so fun in their unique way. And I like the level design of this game. Like I said, it's, it's the Breath of the Wild map, but not destroyed. It's so beautiful. Oh my god, they, have, they take so much, so many hits. Okay, let's see what Imp is about. Ooh. She slices as well. We can generate symbols. And then we can absorb them. And then absorb them back in. Interesting. Oh, the symbols, oh, they like duplicate me. There's multiple Impas. And then I can absorb them and get extra attack power. And we can use bombs too. Yeah. Ah, go in! He's down! Weak point! The item on the ground. Perhaps an enemy dropped it. What is it? A fire rod. That's cool. How do I use it? Oh, cool. <laughs> I forgot about the fire rod. It's so amazing. 
Okay, where's Link at? Is he okay? Let's get up to whatever's up here. And there's so many blue, blue bacoblins. These guys take so many hits. Or one special attack. Apples. Can I not eat my apple? Do I not have apples? Did I use them all? Oh, lizards. Suddenly lizards. Let's go in here. Whoa, I can freeze enemies on water with Cryonis? That's a cool combo. That's really useful. Come on. Where's your leader? Show me your leader. Where's he at? There he is. Come in the water. I'll freeze you. I'll freeze you with the Cryonis. Oh, it didn't work. What? Oh, wait. Dude, excuse your ass. That's how it's done. He went all the way out with that. Stealing their meat, their horns, a bit of everything. Did I still don't have any, where'd my healing items go? Didn't I find apples? Where did those head to? Hold L. Oh, there's my food. I was holding the wrong button. Yo, Korok? Sweet. Ooh, can I hit that? Ow, holy jizz stain. Come on. I mean, they, they did just come on me, I guess. I just destroyed their outposts. Holy crap. <laughs> I don't know if I could destroy those entirely. And I get a prize too? Hell yeah. High lizard tail. High tail lizard. That's the lizard that allows me to be fireproof, I think. Got some bacoblin guts. Nice. Blow it up. No TNT left unblown. Okay, we're just going in. So yeah, I have never played a Dynasty Warriors game. I have only played Hyrule Warriors. So I don't know what the original games from this franchise are like that the Hyrule Warriors games are based on. But from what I know, aren't the Dynasty Warriors games kind of like Hyrule Warriors, but with like real life war generals and stuff as the playable characters? Stay in bed. Wait, I can't use the bomb again. Reload faster! Whatever. Didn't need it anyways. And now there's Dragon Quest Warriors, there's Fire Emblem Warriors. And... Dude, a Mario Warriors game would be pretty sick. I could really picture a Mario Warriors game. In fact, I think Mario Warriors would be probably one of the most fun ones. Yeah, imagine this being, just like swiping up hundreds of Goombas and Koopas. Would be a very swell time. Here, let's use Impa on this last one. She's cl way closer. Whoa, was this Lawnmon Ranch? That's like some sort of ranch. Oh, was that a Korok in the middle of it? Oh, this is Lon Lon Ranch. Or it's inspired. Inspired by. Yeah. 
Does Impa have the Naruto run? She does. Why, why does she run like Naruto? <laughs> Impa is going to be first in the lunch line. It's freaking pizza day. She is not going to be last in line for pizza day. Do what you do best, Impa. Fuck it up, fuck it up, fuck it up. Oh yeah, that was good. Don't be screaming at me. No screaming. Show me your leader. There he is. He's just going down. Hiya! Prage. Moblins have appeared. Yo, Link, what are you looking at? There's a. Another fire wizard robe. Not on my watch. Whoa! Dude, he got them. He got some attacks. Can I use fire on him? Does that do anything? I don't think it does. Why does Flurry rush his ass? That's what I'm talking about. Didn't see that one coming. Blow the whole shit up. Somehow all the architecture in the Zelda universe is bomb proof. Bombs don't blow up bridges, they don't blow up houses, nothing. It just hurt people. I guess they're almost like magic bombs if you think about it. Okay, where are my where are my moblins mobbing? Where's the mob? Oh wait here. Start with Cryonis. The music got so dramatic. <laughs> Come on, they're just moblins. No need to be so over the top. Moblins have like the longest forehead, forehead horns. Unicorns could never. Oh, Impa came through? I'm so weak right now. He's weak, he's weak. That still didn't kill him? Wait, give me my Cryonis. It's actually a good time to use this. Moblins don't have rights. Moblins are kill on sight. They're too dangerous. Damn, when you're not leveled up in this game, things take forever. I forget how hard just regular moblins are at the very beginning of the game before you level up your characters. Link, you're so weak. You're so weak. Give me the meats. Whoa. Perfect timing. Ow, he just kicked me in the face. Freaking rude. Hey, the monsters are retreating. And that is how it's done, ladies and gentlemen. You fall well, and victory is your reward. Savor it. Thank you, King Rome. Thank you. That young knight served his kingdom well. Perhaps an official appointment is in order. The Battle of Hyrule Fields. They should be teaching this one in the history books. All right, we got some potentially better weapons. Whoa, we got the honeycomb. Honeycomb. 
We've got a lot of ingredients on this first playthrough. 852 Bacoblin trophies. Are those like all the obituaries of all the enemies we killed? <laughs> Gruesome. I love it. Hmm. An inexplicable guardian. <gasps> and a mysterious tower. I hate to say it, but we have little hope of figuring this out on our own. Zelda looking dramatic. Served your kingdom admirably. Huh. Zelda being so dramatic. Burgeoning scholar. You made it. I'm glad you're safe, Impa. Yes, your highness. And I've received the Sheikah slate from Pora. Hmm? Oh. She loves it. It's so cute. <laughs> Scuttlebug. Scuttlebug. It's Sheikah technology. The Sheikah slate conveyed the little guardian's purpose. This anomalous visitor had traveled from a future of ruin, a time in the midst of the calamity, to save Princess Zelda. Impa proposed recruiting Pura and Robbie, renowned researchers of ancient technology, to study the Guardian and investigate the mysterious tower that had appeared on Hyrule Field. King Rome of Hyrule gave his assent. Gotta go find Robbie and Pura? But they're young this time, young Robbie and Pura. The moment the little guy went back in time, a second timeline was created. Oh no, don't get into this multiple timeline stuff. That's my least favorite thing about time travel is multiple universes in different times. <sighs> my brain's gonna catch on fire thinking about it. An order for Link, the Hylian Knight. You must guard the mysterious tower that has appeared. I'm told it may be important. As for this time of hopping guardian, it is truly deserving of our trust? You must discern him beyond any doubt with the aid of the researchers. May the goddess Hylia watch over you always. King Rome. I don't even want to try to read Rome's last name. Looks like blasphemous, but it's like blasphemous. I'm Link, the Silent Knight, a skilled swordsman, serving the royal family of Hyrule. Born to a line of imperial guards, he is renowned for his fighting skills and courage. That's some beautiful artwork. I love that artwork. Empa! Royal advisor and loyal friends. The advisor to Hyrule's royal family and a revered member of the Sheikah tribe. She is dedicated to her work and known for being steadfa steadfast and diligent. She can be distractible at times. It's pronounced Rome Boss for a Mus. Rome Boss for a Mus. Boss for a Mus, nice. The Hylian map. This is one of my favorite things about this Hyrule Warriors game is this this map right here. If I can show it to you. We got the lucky ladle. This is for the DLC, the prototype ancient helm. Prototype ancient cuirass. Prototype ancient greaves. The ancient sword. Damn, they're hooking us up. Is that all the DLC stuff? Cool. Okay. See, I love how it's the Breath of the Wild map, but we get tons of missions like, around the map. So that first one was in Hyrule Fields, right in front of the castle. We have a side quest, hot meals in a pot. The head cook of the Hylian army has shown you a cooking pot. Good fortifying meals can make all the difference. Try it out. Strike up a fire and get cooking. 
So we have the materials needed. Let's do it. Whip it up, whip it up, whip it up. You got the fire going and cooked for the first time. Now with a pot, a fire, and the right ingredients, you'll be able to cook a variety of dishes. Do it whenever you need sustenance. We learned to make steamed meat. Mmm. No flavor, just steamed meat. Progress! Complete quests in the region to contribute there. Work together with the denizens across the kingdom to grow stronger and fight against the calamity. That's right. More side quests? Oh, we don't have the ingredients. Hyrule Sword Fighting Academy. A great sword fighter wants to start a monster fighting workshop, but she lacks materials to build her classroom. Help provide the resources she needs. She will needs a bunch of bacoblin horns. All right, we made her horny. Hell yeah. With the materials Link provided, the class master built a perfect classroom. As thanks for this help, she offered to let him join the class. And we learned an extra attack, hey! We helped them out and got some free lessons out of it. That's some good exchange of skills if I've ever seen it. Can we go up here? The lights of home. Impa ran across a merchant in the Hebra region who lamented that it had been years since his last journey home to Kakarika village. Maybe a few souvenirs will ease his homesick heart. Oh yeah, they, they grow carrots and pumpkins in Kakariko. And there's a bunch of fireflies. I knew I could do it. Seeing the luminous fireflies from his beloved hometown, the merchant's face crinkled into a warm, nostalgic smile. Now that home didn't feel so far away. He could happily return to work. Impa leveled up, leveled up. Let's go Impa leveled up. So proud of her. Our girl.